good everybody that's for kicks here welcome back to the channel today we have the travis scott jordan one low medium olives let's go ahead and check them out Alright guys, so this pair comes from True Shoes. They were nice enough to include this little paper right here with all of their info being their site, their Instagram, their WhatsApp. They even were cool enough to give me a little code, Dusty, for a $15 discount. So definitely use that if you're going to check out this seller because every little bit helps. First things first, we have the box. Now it is cream on top with Nike and the swoosh in a light brown. Come out of the inside of the box, so you do have that Cactus Jack and Nike Air and Air Jordan pink tissue paper right there that we are pretty much used to seeing at this point it's been on i want to say all of his releases of ones since the very first pair as far as accessories go you did get some pink wax laces to go with it and you also got some black wax laces getting into the actual shoes side panels you'll see are this really nice soft suede maybe nubuck material Plenty of movement right there with my finger you can see and I haven't hit it with a suede brush or anything like that. So this is right out of the box. It is a hard color to kind of pick up on camera. I will say in person, it is a light brown kind of green olive mixture, if that makes any sense. White leather down the lace guard around the toe box as well as back here. You have a nice soft black tumbled leather for the reverse swoosh. You'll see the midsole is a nice stained yellow vintage aesthetic color. Outsole, we're met with that mix between kind of like an olive brown with the Nike hit right there on the center. Cone of the toe box, just like the side panels, you still have that nice soft suede nubuck with some movement there. And it is in that medium olive brown colorway. White laces, by default, you saw the pink and black it comes with. The nylon tongue, again, is like that olive brown green. Tongue tag at first right here is white with Nike, the Sushin Air in red. And then you have the side one over here, the Cactus Jack in an olive green. Coming to the inside of the shoe, you have that brown olive sock liner colorway. You can see the insole. I'll put pictures right here on the screen. It's the same as the ones we've seen previously where it says Cactus Jack. It has the Jumpman logo and all that fun stuff. Back side of the shoe, you still have white leather here as well as for the heel tab. You have the Sigamode cactus jack face whatever you guys call it embroidered in red he is smiling sometimes he's frowning sometimes he's smiling never know which one they're going to go with medial side to finish up the shoe you still have white leather back here as well as down the lace guard and around the toe box side panels you still have that medium olive mix with brown for the suede new buck you still have a regular swoosh instead of a reverse swoosh right here it is that nice thick one that ogs had that i love it's still in that black tumbled leather. Another change, you can see the Cactus Jack little logo or monogram, whatever you guys want to call it, right there in red. Checking out the right shoe, pretty much everything is the same as the left. You'll see the Cactus Jack logo is on the opposite side. You'll see there is Travis Scott imprinted on the insole instead of what you saw on the other one. And then the back logo, instead of the Sycamore face, you have the Air Jordan Wings logo embroidered in red. All right, so if it's not broke, don't fix it. That seems to be the motto for Nike and Travis Scott as they have released what seems to be several, several colorways of the Jordan 1 low for Travis Scott. It is wild to me, and I believe I remember them saying three colorways or so ago that that was the last one to drop and we just keep getting more and more. That was before they even said the Canary Yellows. And now we have these coming. I've seen images of maybe a pink pair or just all kinds of different ones. 
Now this one, it's not my favorite. It's not at the top of the list, but it's also not at the bottom of the list. Now the colorway, it's pretty neutral. You know, his Travis Scott neutral tones, the earth tones, that kind of is what he goes towards for the most part, other than that canary yellow pair that just dropped that definitely gives me X-Men vibes. It's not a bad colorway by any means. It does remind me of that golf colorway that he released whenever that was a year or two ago. It's very similar to that. The side panels, the toe box and all that stuff, it is, right now it kind of looks like a brown. In person, it really is like a weird brownish olive colorway. I don't hate it, I don't love it. I am interested to know what everybody else thinks of this and where it really ranks on their list of all the Travis Scott lows. Because let's be honest, He's come out with so many, and at this point, if you're like me, you kind of want something new. That's why the Jumpman Jack that he's coming out with, that new silhouette, is just a really dope, refreshing thing. But these, let me know if you need these in your collection or not. Alright guys, just like always, I really appreciate you coming to the channel and hanging out for a bit. Till next time, I'm Dustin for Kicks. Peace.